Hey guys, this is your weekly forecast for the 1st of December 2019 for all the signs. If you would like a private reading with me or hypnosis to facilitate permanent change, to use the link below and our Christmas vouchers are up now. So this week it looks like you're going away for work or starting a new job. This could be your partner as well. There is a leaving of um, one place, right time, right search, and we are going uh, new, new areas. So this is starting a new job. We're in the next leg of our job. We're going away for our job. This is also about walking away from finances that we have been relying on. So if you're relying on a partner and you're getting divorced, or if you have... Uh, been relying on benefits of some sort, uh, family, doesn't matter what it is. It looks like some of you this week are actually going to walk away from that and have your own funds. Some of you, when this comes to a financial matter, when it comes to the other in your life, and this is about some sort of separation, some sort of... Um, you know, uh, divorce or something like that. We do have the uh, Four of Wands. Now, this is Sagittarius Leo or Aries, but this is about a new home, a happy home, a celebration at home. And this is about family as well. So for some of you, this is finally done. We've wrapped it all up and uh, we're buying a new home. We're happy at home, those kinds of things as well. For others, this is, okay, I'm leaving behind my debt. I am getting a mortgage for my home. So even financially, this is leaving behind things. And it's also about, you know, mortgages, loans, uh, windfalls, taxes, those sorts of things as well. Lastly, I want to say this is a Pisces Scorpio Cancer, but there is a, um, a Capricorn or a uh, Virgo around this as well. It looks like close to the new moon that there's going to be a uh, turnaround. It looks like there's going to be a change there. Now, um, if you are uh, doing your own business, uh, this is passive income, you might find that you're on to the next uh, tax bracket or you're on to the next leg of that. At our home, we do have the Four of Wands, and this has got some uh, protection over here, so you are protected, a little bit of luxury. Someone's coming home. I feel like someone's coming home. Um, as well as on top of that, we've got something to celebrate. Now, there is a proposal of sorts because we've got the Four of Wands in our home and then we've got a Yes card and this is also a victory. This is a public declaration. So there's some sort of proposal here for some of you. Um, you know, this is deadly serious agreements, births, deaths and marriages, so it is wills and things like that. So you're putting those together and um, some of us are getting engaged this week. Some of us, you know, it's a proposal of sorts, whether it's getting engaged, moving in together, actual wedding, uh, announcing a baby so there's a lot to celebrate at home uh, this week now with your health you do have the queen of wands now this is a bit of a fertility uh, card with the sunflower uh, and we've got the leo here as well which is our family in terms of a uh, health issue i feel like this is going to be readdressed i feel like you're going to be um i, th I think that if there's been a, an appointment if there's been um you know, some kind of outcome. I feel like this is going to be looked at again, uh, called back in, um, we're returning in some way, we're being readdressed, um, because I feel like there's more information. Now, for some of you, there could have been a dicey uh, situation with your health uh, this week, uh, but it is going to be okay. So if this is about, you know, some sort of pregnancy and there's some spotting, some bleeding, you know, some cramping, something like that, it is going to be okay. If this is in terms of, you know, um, something that's inherited or something that's being flaring up and we're all worried about what those results are, it is going to be okay. And back to love. This is a fire sign, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. This is um, someone we spend our day with. This person is someone in a um, in a some sort of leadership position or you know in front of the camera or marketing something like that as well. This is a yes. This is a very positive card. So those of you in a committed relationship, we're celebrating a milestone of some sort or a decision about our future in some sort. So three of these cards are Sagittarius, Leo, and Aries. And this one here is Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer. But there is something to do with the new moon in conjunction with the full moon where the, we are leaving that chapter behind. We are leaving. So even if you are, that's the date that you finish this job and you're off to the new one, or if you are moving for your job. Yeah, so if you are moving for your job, say you're relocating to another state or another country, 
you're off on your travels, right time, right search, you've you know, got the position and you're able to find the house to go with that. So your Doreen Virtue messages from the angels for this week is... So Les says what well, was on the other side of the mountain, you cannot see that. And this could be for some of you stemming back to June or July, which is coming up this week, and you know, haven't had any answers or didn't know what the details are, or there's been stress back and forth since then. Uh, everything is going to work out this week by the uh, Saturday. Uh, you're going to have those answers. You're going to have that smooth road ahead that you've been looking for. Layla says it's time for you to sit back and think about what it is you really want. If this is about leaving my employer, my own passive income, do I make the big decision to um, go back to school, big decision to you know, move careers completely or move countries completely, this is something that you really, really want, this has got to be about you, also with the proposal that's going on here as well, it's about what you really, really want and nobody else, oh, so Oceana, again, um, this is another uh, family card as well. So for some of you, it is, it is about pregnancy um, this week. Uh, this card says you've got to go beyond what it is that you fear. You've got to rise above it. And you do have the, uh, so it's almost like I have been worried too much in my thoughts. I've drifted so far out that the, you know I haven't been able to see reality. There's been wishy-washy. I don't know what the details are. Um, but as the close of this week, you're actually going to be able to rise up. The, the, um, you're getting up to, you can see the light through the top of the water. And lastly, asking the decision that's right for you. So you've got to go with your gut instincts. You've got to think about yourself and nobody else. What is it that you want? And this is the time to do it. So be kind to you and those you love. And from Jedi side, Jake, may the force be with you.